first I'm going to make a new project. I'll call this one a line follower because that's what it's going to do. The first thing that we're going to need is a loop because the robot is going to be readjusting periodically. We'll also need a switch. I don't want the touch sensor and I'm going to use the color sensor because my light detector doesn't work uh, correctly. I'm changing the range to black because that's the color of my line. My color detector is on port 3 and that's what's checked so that's great. If you have say a red color line then you should set it to red. Now if it sees the color of the line which is black then I want it to actually turn away. So I'm going to make my right motor, which is motor B, go forward at 75% power until it's told to do something else, so it's going to be set at unlimited. I want my left motor, motor C, to do nothing, so that it turns left. Now if the color sensor does not see the color of the line and it sees say white which is behind it then I want it to turn towards the line. So I'm going to make motor B do nothing this time while motor C goes forward at 75% power until it's told to do something else. Now you can see that if the sensor detects the uh, color of the line, it's going to turn away from it, and then it won't see the color, so it's going to turn back onto it. If it does this again and again, it will end up zigzagging over the edge of the line. You can see that as the robot moves, it shakes back and forth. This is because the sensor is moving over the edge of the line. It isn't actually detecting the line itself, but the edge of it.